the game. It's a red stick. Hello guys today in this video, we are going to help you to find out the best inflatable kayaks in market. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I tried to list them based on their quality, durability, customer review and more. If you want to see their price and find out more information about them, you can check our links in the description below. Number 10. Advanced Elements Advanced Frame It's a rare occurrence that one of the top performing models in any category is also one of the highest value items for budget-conscious shoppers. But that's exactly what the Advanced Elements Advanced Frame brings to the table. This metal stiffened craft is our favorite inflatable kayak and available for a comparatively reasonable price. The aluminum reinforced keel creates a V-shape that tracks well and cuts through the water far better than the flat bottom of most other models. The bottom of the advanced frame is a water-resistant plastic-like material that lowers drag and helps you glide through the water faster and with less effort. In terms of the actual on-water paddling experience, this boat tracks better, goes faster, and catches less wind than any other inflatable option we tested. It has a thick seat that's comfortable, adjustable, and can handily accommodate some extra gear, a medium dog, or a small child along for the ride. Number 9. Or Beach LT. The Oru Beach LT is one. Even after several years of testing, storing, toting, and paddling, and in direct comparison with the smaller Oru Lake, this foldable plastic watercraft remains our favorite. Once you've gotten used to folding and unfolding this boat, it's a cinch to get out on the water, and you don't need a pump. It's longer than most others, providing excellent traction, while its plastic hull limits drag and help you paddle as quickly as you desire. The large, open cockpit is wide enough to please both new paddlers and those who've been enjoying kayaking for years. We had no problems hauling gear, 80-plus pound dogs, and kids in this big boat. Though it's picked up a few cosmetic scratches, this craft is still our all-time favorite option for casual, flat-water paddling. If you're hoping to crash through some waves in your kayak, the very open design of the Beach LT can let waves lap inside. Number 8. Sevular Quickpack K5 Inflatable Kayak The Sevular Quickpack K5 Inflatable Kayak has an impressive amount of storage space for an inflatable kayak, so you can bring along the gear and food you need for a multi-day kayak camping adventure. There are two large series of bungee tie-down straps, and there is a storage compartment built into the stern of the hull. The backpack that's used to carry the packed down Quickpack K5 turns into the seat so you don't have to choose between leaving it behind or stowing it away. That backpack slash seat combination makes it easy to portage this kayak over large areas of land as needed. Just watch out in shallower water as the skag on the bottom of the kayak is permanently attached and can be an issue if it hits bottom. Also, plan to replace the paddle that comes included with this kayak as it is reportedly terrible, but since this boat costs well under $200, you will have some cash left on hand to do so. Number 7. Intex Excursion Pro Inflatable Kayak An Intex Excursion Pro Inflatable Kayak will set you back less than $275, but can accommodate two adult paddlers. It comes with all sorts of accessories, including removable fishing rod holders, a phone mount, an accessory mounting bracket, and even paddles. The Excursion Pro also includes a handy pump that can be used to inflate the kayak in just a few minutes. Long broad and stable this is a good choice for those newer to paddling the excursion pro is on the heavier side for an inflatable kayak and its 400 pound maximum weight capacity is rather low for a tandem kayak but most couples or a parent slash kid combo can safely enjoy it when used as a solo kayak it allows for bringing along a lot of gear such as you might want for a long day of fishing number six a quay glide day scoots 145 tandem inflatable kayak an Equaglide de Scoots 145 Tandem Inflatable Kayak is a great choice for a pair of paddling enthusiasts with limited storage space at home. It packs down small enough to fit on a shelf or in a closet. Yet when fully inflated, this is a commanding kayak that measures 14.5 feet long and has an impressive 600-pound weight capacity. It can easily accommodate two adults in some gear, thanks to dual sets of bungee tied-down straps and ample space behind the rear paddler. Out of the water, four handles make transporting this 27-pound kayak easy. 
On the water, the padded and adjustable seats are comfortable and supportive. The Day Scoots 145 is easy to inflate but can be quite a chore packing down small enough to get it back into its included carrying backpack. Number 5. Aquaglide Day Scoots 110 Inflatable Kayak. The Aquaglide Day Scoots 110 Inflatable Kayak is a long, lightweight, reliable kayak that handles much like a solid hulled vessel. It's stable enough for use by novice paddlers, yet offers the handling more experienced kayak enthusiasts demand. At less than 20 pounds, but with a 250 pound weight limit, this kayak is suitable for most adults and is easy to carry around off the water. It has multiple handles and it packs down into an included backpack. On the water it tracks well especially with the included fin in place, and it turns deftly, the kayak's light weight aiding its nimble responsiveness. While hardly cheap the day scoots 110 will last for many years with proper care, it's best used on calmer water as larger waves and chop tend to splash over the gunnels and into the cockpit. Number 4. Boat Paddleboard A big perk of inflatable kayaks is their compact storage and portability. The Boat Lowrider Aero Inflatable Hybrid Paddleboard does one better by combining the functionality of a kayak and paddleboard in a single watercraft. The removable seat and four-piece carbon-slash-fiberglass paddle make for a swift and seamless switch from paddleboarding to kayaking, and vice versa. Since there's no footrests, the elevated seating position helps deliver greater power transfer as well as comfort for longer paddles. At 3 feet wide, the Lowrider Aero feels incredibly stable as both a kayak and paddleboard. It also tracks well thanks to a 3-fin steering system. I'm a big fan of the customizable features boat incorporated in the hybrid design. The MagnaPod attachment connects to a magnet tumbler or MagnaBoom waterproof speaker for hydration and entertainment. The deck can also be equipped with a cooler or fishing gear systems. Number 3. Advanced Elements Advanced Frame Sport Kayak The Advanced Elements Advanced Frame Sport Inflatable Kayak is built with rugged adventure in mind. The exterior features double-coated ripstop fabric and welded seams, plus PVC along the bottom. Meanwhile, the interior is designed with seven air chambers, including both an inner and outer chamber that encompass the entire kayak. If the outer chamber gets punctured through the hull, the inner chamber serves as backup flotation to still be able to navigate back to shore. A repair kit adds further assurance that paddlers can address leaks if they arise. I appreciate that the kit includes detailed instructions for use. Besides durability, the Advanced Frame Sport boasts solid handling and performance in large part due to the reinforced aluminum hull. Whereas most inflatable kayaks have flat bottoms, the Advanced Frame Sport resembles a traditional kayak hull. Number 2. Intex Challenger K1 Kayak Inflatable Set If you're new to kayaking, the Intex Challenger K1 Inflatable Kayak is a budget-friendly vessel for getting the knack of flat water paddling. It comes with a paddle and hand pump included, a great value for under $100. The 9-foot kayak is easy to maneuver, while a removable skeg helps with tracking. In terms of comfort, the incline of the inflatable seat can be adjusted, as can the position of the footrest. The cargo net on the front of the boat is sufficient for storing a water bottle extra layer or dry bag. However, the Challenger K1's shorter design and maximum weight capacity of 220 pounds present some limitations for transporting gear or larger paddlers step into the outdoors and prepare for an adventure with the Intex Challenger K1, a one-person inflatable kayak designed for fishing and recreational use. Number 1. A Quayglide Inflatable Kayak With a 600-pound weight capacity, the Aquaglide Day Scoots 145 Tandem can comfortably hold a pair of paddlers, plus camping gear, young kids, or pets, depending on your needs. In my case, our 70-pound dog was content to occupy the floor behind the front seat with room still for my legs. The boat's V-floor feels very firm, so a pet or fellow passenger shifting about won't destabilize the craft. Despite its size and tandem design, inflating and setting up the Day Scoots 145 is quite simple. First, inflate the two side walls, then the two cross pieces. The one behind the front seat is a handy footrest for the rear paddler. And then install the padded seats. There are corresponding Velcro straps on the seats and floor of the kayak as well as two straps that attach to the sidewall to adjust the seat back. I love that the seats are non-inflatable, as the ventilation and ergonomic support makes longer excursions much more enjoyable. 